Right, hello again. Today we're going to try and make a volcano and this is something you can do at home. It's using things from your kitchen. Please ask permission before you steal all of your um, parents' ingredients from their kitchen. But the first thing you're going to need is some bicarbonate of soda and some kind of a, a vessel to do it in. I'm using a conical flask, but you could just use an empty drinks bottle. That would be great for this. So first thing I'm going to do is put a couple of scoops of bicarb into our bottle or into our jar and because I want it to be quite an explosive volcano I'm going to use a little bit of washing up liquid here so just some fairy, a few drips of this and just to make it a bit more colourful I'm going to put in a few drops of red food dye to make it look a bit like lava you can use whatever colour you've got at home though I don't have any problem if you're having a blue volcano or a green volcano that will be fine now, to make our volcano actually erupt, we're going to need to mix something with this bicarb in our beaker. And the liquid we're going to use is vinegar. So if this is malt vinegar, you can use white wine vinegar, anything you have to have in the house. And it is going to go and mix with our bicarb and hopefully cause an eruption. Okay, Let's see if it's going to come out the top. I'm not sure how much I'm going to put in. It might make a mess. You might want to do this outside or in a tray or in your kitchen near a sink. Okay, so we'll see what happens. Whoop, there we go. Definitely perhaps one for the outside. You might not want to do this in your living room near a carpet, but I think this makes quite a nice volcano. Perhaps a bit more uh, red food colouring next time. It's quite an explosive volcano, this one. But as you can see, it's a bit of a smelly one as well. The vinegar's a little bit smelly, but uh, it does make a lovely explosion. And if you were feeling really creative, you could actually produce a volcano around the outside, maybe with paper mache or sand or modelling clay or whatever you might have at home. That would be a great uh, volcanic eruption.